so as these are some of them uh, this is they call burrito uh, shrek ears nga siya ni shrek um these are the jades that I have at the bottom. I have variegated. And then, um, I have some that kay kailangan ako i-pamper. So, na sila dira ginataguan na ako. Uh, and then, this one too. Some arrangement. Uh, I have another little here. They call it Royal Flash. That one, that small one there. Um, and then, of course, um, I do leaf propagation like this so they're starting to propagate now there and then my favorites are here uh, because they're the, they're the most colorful that I have right now this is Debbie uh, they call it Debbie it's supposed to be very it's supposed to be pinkish but because shorter na ang sun so the, 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 co the colors are turning to green and maybe on spring or summer they will come back this one is another one it, it's, it should be pinkish this is they call um, what they call it I forgot its name <laughs> pero mas purple ni siya kaayo than the one that the other one that I showed first this is also another one this is the, uh, the one of the version that's bluish na succulent and then uh, this one too it's supposed to be purple but yeah same thing this is they called Echeveria Lola it's supposed to be purple but now if you notice they're a little bit greenish now I love this one too because uh, their, their tips are pink this is more purple and of course uh, uh, this one too is what they call um, I forgot the name <laughs> so these are my favorites at the top I want them really to have enough sun but unfortunately now because winter is coming it's really uh, struggling then these are some other plants or succulents that I have it's a combination so uh, I posted before they're very colorful but now we're losing light so succulents are very tricky this is one of my favorites sa uh, akong collections of chick and chicks and chicks and hen or they call it simperbivum family ang iyang color is really like more on reddish maroon kind. so it's rare my husband found it in home depot so murag Pachamba chamba siya usahay. Like, you have to be really keen. Oh, and I also go to this one uh, wholesale place. Uh, they don't have the rarest, but if you're really into it, you just find it. Kanang mangita lang yun ka. Magchaga lang yun kasi lang nursery. But I found some really rare um, plants there. I have this too. It's like, Roshagi aphids. Kay puti kay siyang. But it's, it's really like that. Uh, so those are like the plants that I I mean the succulents that I have um, I I'm it's hard to find like variegated na barato lang but I, I, I when I find one I usually order them these are ones of those the, the mature ones become black the new ones become I mean the new leaves are green but once they mature they become it's not black actually it's more dark purple color dark red mm. so um, I find like mm. someone is selling me for $70 one succulent and I am like this is too much uh, ang collection ako para lang malipay ko <laughs> to remove my homesickness of my place but it's not really for to really like go like they call it um kanang hardcore yun kang a collector for uh, because i have no space right now i have i have a small baby that needs to take care, that i have to take care more and i have a, 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 a first grader so my time is hati and then it's so different here because um uh, like 
kinahang dili lang ka manilhig, kinanglan pa ka mag trapo, kinanglan may mga cleaner. So, what I did is I just do this for now and my I, I've run out of space. So, I I told my husband that I'll stop now and I'm, and take care of what what I have right now and then some of them I planted outside the colorful ones. Pero ning mga really rare na ako ng mga collection ginatago ng madri sa likod kay gagmay siya basig mainteresan bitbiton kaya ang among house is agianan bago mo adto ang beach so mo adto og dagat so saturdays and sundays there would be a lot of visitors who would be coming and you, our our fence is very low and then it has no it's not like gated so they could just access and our doors might be closed and we don't know if someone wala man ko naging ginabuhat nila pero we're just trying to avoid because of course dili man siya namo gipangayo lang so my 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 rare ones are here at the back and it's like a secret garden um i have kamote here okay uh i have tanglad here mm. And then I have kamote. Kaya akong plan lagi ka ng mag-gimingaw na kong bagong kamote. So I'm planting my own kamote here. And I have a malunggay here that my husband planted. I think it was given to him. And then I have tomatoes here which I'm struggling kay ginakaon po siya sa caterpillar. So... Uh, it's a little bit difficult to maintain this. I have my Italian basil. I have my mayana for in case magkubo-ubo ni akong mga sakop dere. And then I have some succulents here that are still uh, that I'm taking care of. But the colors just turned again going back to green because of lack of sunlight for now. So I have ivy. And then, yeah, th this is my tiny place where I I hang out before I have Ethel fled. But since I ha she's here now, lesser na akong time. Di na kayo na ko sila ma ma ma, ma di na ko ka kastey og dugay dere. I just usually just water them, check on them. And one thing is, litops usually grows this way. Uh, the new plant would come out like this so it's like that uh, if you have litops I don't know if you have experience already that so um, yeah these are my collections hobbies so there this is my string of hearts because it looks like a heart um, yeah those are the things that my husband likes because I could just um, like they have string of bananas, string of pearls, string of hearts, and I don't have string of. Uh, they also have string of dolphins, I think, and then there's another one that looks like string of tears. I don't know, I forgot. So, uh, there's a. Ang, ang plan na ko is at least five varieties for each family na a highlight, like for example, in Anna. But yeah, as of now, I ran out of space. So, I don't want to just put them here together and basig mamatay sila. So, sayang siya. Sayang ang kwarta. <laughs> so, I'm trying to just take care of what I have right now and trying to propagate through using leaves because they're very easy. Of course, it's once they have babies, I also transplanted them. Um, I don't know what, where will my hobby bring me someday. But I'm really like planning if someone is because they're selling here on my on our local neighborhood. There's an app that, that you could post if you have products, and they're selling succulents. But the succulents they're selling are just the common one. So I'm planning like if I have the rarest, I could just sell them someday. It's not for except for money. Uh, you could have money from that but it's also like a fulfillment that you were able to propagate a lot so uh, every afternoon we go here sometimes with this girl and she loves to be here like a monkey on my she's we're, we're like a kangaroo here so we go here and check if 
i-attack na sila sa amo ang mga caterpillar and sometimes I do unspraying because I have to take care and protect them unfortunately. So there, that's all. That's how I started with my collections. It's my husband who really motivates me to do it and I thank him for being supportive of what I have right now and until next video, bye bye. Wait, 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 no, don't say bye bye. Okay, wait. Smack the like button and give us a subscribe to our channel and give us a thumbs up. Or do not give us a thumbs down. Just smack that like button. Okay, okay. bye bye. Bye bye.